hello and welcome to julie adventure vlogs thank you for clicking to watch today's video you're highly appreciated as you can see the excitement is real and it's embarkation day this video is particularly to show you our nice and cozy cabin on drum rolling piano cruises azura if you've not watched the full embarkation day vlog on this channel then please do so after this video you will love it we received a really warm and welcoming reception boarding or embarking on piano azura and it was a fly cruise i won't spoil it just watch that vlog it's a vlog before this one and our cabin is on the 12th on piano azura piano azura names every deck according to a different country and we had the privilege of living in australia <laughs> not the real australia you understand what i mean piano azura cruise ship on the 12th known as australia finding our cabin was really quick and easy as soon as we got off the lift we followed the signage and on our way we met our able house service staff who pointed us straight to our cabin a534 midship piano azura right in front of the cabin as you can see we have a newsletter there the horizon it tells us everything that is going to be happening in the evening of today and tomorrow and also we have our special envelope Ooh, our cabin card to let ourselves in hello come right hi. in <laughs> so right here we have a nice mirror <laughs> so it's a twin room what do we have here good storage spaces as you can see each bed has its own side cupboard so like bedside light on each side of the twin bed and the wall socket to control central lighting all the information you need telephone central light switches and more sockets hi another nice mirror here that big mirror there if you turn around two lovely frames oh my god the size of that tv okay and another mirror <laughs> so fridge will be filling in kettle more sockets but the sockets are all uk adapted if you're coming from other parts of the world you will need an adapter and there's no usb specific socket so there are two chairs this one the office chair and this one the relaxing here cupboards here just like the other one it's nice table and a bin and there's more storage under the bed yeah oh there's a little plastic there you see i wonder what's under here look what i found under the bed the plastic container um, I guess or we imagine it's for special laundry. So if you wanted the company to do a special laundry for you, you put it in there and hand over. That's what I assume it is. Anyway, under the bed can also add as an extra storage for your empty luggage. Let's continue. That's the door to the entrance of the cabin. Behind it is the safety room. Beside it are switches and the key card housing look what we found a walk-in wardrobe area Ooh, nice cupboard with safe and a lot of um, shelving to make unpacking easy hangers look at that and the life jacket is also inside the room it's like walk-in wardrobe situation so let's close that socket Oh wow, this is the smallest bathroom I've been on a ship. Well, it's a vintage ship, so I have to make do with it. Toilet. 
shower curtain. Oh dear. Never had a shower curtain because I've been on two new ships. Oh, my favorite thing, white company. Shower gel and shampoo. One thing, one big plus for piano cruise. Line hanger. Hold. Is that a tap or something? I'm not sure what that is. Um, under the sink, you have that. Okay. And this is the thermostat that controls the temperature of the room for heating and also for air conditioning. Remember, if you leave the cabin door open, it trips off. Ooh, someone at the door. Hello, welcome. Hello. Come in, come in. <laughs> this is Eva, my travel companion. You are going to show us what the balcony looks like. Are we ready? Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, we can wait. We can wait. Let's see what we got here. Ooh. Oh my god, look at that view. Remember to watch the full embarkation video after this. Now, this is a good size balcony. So we have recliner seats, waterproof, of course, and recliner seats. Oh god, look at Tenerife at its best. I love my balcony cabins. I know they are more expensive, but I find other aspects of my cruise to cut costs. I cannot not have these spectacular views, the fresh sea breeze, and the spectacle during sail away. It's not negotiable for now. It's the balcony cabin for me. So, there's a bit of shade there. I, I don't mind. It's only ever we want some time. So, the sun will be away for a while. And below, I'm sure that is a deck 10 sticking out there, and probably the deck 9. What do you think, Eva? Oh, it's okay. It's really <laughs> lovely. I like it. Vintage has its flaws, so yes, as much as it looks older, I'm happy with it. It's clean, and it looks like everything is working, and I'm happy so far. So far, so good. But Remember, if you've not subscribed, this is the time to hit that subscribe button, like, leave your comment. I love to hear from you. Share, share, share. Till I see you next time, don't forget, life is for living, for love and laughter. <laughs> see ya. Bye.